What's up guys, Jade's Corner back here again for yet another episode of my Fantasy Fight series. And in today's video, I'm going to be going over who will win in a fight to the death between the Nogatsune and Catherine Pierce from The Vampire Diaries. Who is coming out on top? Let's find out. First, we're going to cover Catherine since the Nogatsune has been covered numerous times on the channel. And I don't think I really need to go over him any more than I already have. So we're going to start with Catherine. So Catherine is a vampire from the Vampire Diaries. She is over 500 years old and is the doppelganger of the main female protagonist of the first six seasons, Elena Gilbert. She is also a Petrova doppelganger as well, originating from the line that started with Amara who was the world's first immortal man, Silas's uh, long lost love, who ended up being the anchor to the other side. So as a vampire, what powers does Catherine possess? So Catherine possesses superhuman speed, superhuman strength, superhuman durability, only being able to be killed by getting her head decapitated or being killed by a stake. So now that Catherine is out the way, and I basically went over you know, the general power she has, and general weaknesses um who do i think is coming out on top because i like i said i'm not going over the nogatsune in this video i've already gone over him numerous times and i've done a whole bunch of videos with him this month already alone so if you want to check out what his powers and abilities are go watch those other fantasy fights videos they'll be linked in the playlist at the end of the video on screen but who do i think is coming out on top in this one and that and that is probably the nogatsune for me so the reason why the nogatsune comes out on number one for me is because he's a lot older he's a lot smarter than Catherine is although you could argue Catherine's intelligence is probably on the level of his but i'd argue he's a little bit smarter because he has 500 years on Catherine, being a thousand years old now physically who's the stronger between the two that's a toss-up because Catherine's really freaking strong and the Nogatsune is really strong as well, being able to toss people around like ragdolls such as Derek Hale. And Catherine's had some pretty good feats of strength as well, being able to overpower supernatural hunters designed uh, purely for the fact and solely for the fact of killing the vampires and eradicating the vampires off the face of the earth. So Catherine is fairly strong in her own right. But I do think the Nogatsune and Catherine, in terms of physical strength, should be evenly matched, in my opinion. And I think that the Nogatsune and Catherine, between, you know, who's faster than the other, I think that the Nogatsune is faster than Catherine because he does have tele teleportation. And I think that Catherine, with her super speed, although it's very quick, like all the other vampires in the Vampire Diaries, I think that the Nogatsune and his ability to teleport being able to instantly appear places what makes his speed on a far greater level than Catherine's speed ever could possibly uh, be at and in terms of durability who's more durable i would have to give that one to Catherine because Catherine can only be killed by a white oak not a white oak stick i'm thinking of the originals a regular uh stake or being her or having her head decapitated or having her heart removed and uh the nogatsune he has a lot more ways to be taken out than Catherine does, which is probably going to, you know, have people in the comments thinking, oh, well, Catherine could just bite the Nogatsune and, uh, well, she can win. And that is a possibility for Catherine. If Catherine wants to use her super speed and bite the Nogatsune and change him, then she wins the fight. But I see this going in Nogatsune's favor, but that's just my opinion. This is all subjective and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, um... 
so yeah, the like I said before, the Nogasune has a whole bunch of different ways of being taken out. He can, if he's if he's not powered up by chaos, strife, and uh, all those negative, you know, sort of like emotions, then he's kind of weak. And also, if he gets bit, like I said before, one of the tactics that Catherine could do, uh, you know, the Shujinda, the Shujinda scroll says that, you know, you can change the host and the Nogatsune will revert back to its original form, which is the fly. So that's a viable option, too. And yeah, um, personally, for me, I see the Nogatsune winning this, but Catherine could win this as well. So do I pick the Nogatsune or do I pick Catherine? I'm not really sure. You know what? I'm going to lean more towards the Nogatsune, but I'm also going to say this could also be a draw as well. So that's my thoughts on who would win that little battle right there. This was a subscriber request. A lot of people are probably going to be like, this is a terrible matchup. Why would you pair these two um, subscriber requests? And I thought it'd be a cool little you know video to do. So if you have any requests for future fantasy fights, drop them in the comment section below. The winner of this video is either a draw or the Nogatsune. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. It's a short one today. Um, this is the last video of March. I just want to say thank you guys for all the support over the last month and 2021 so far. It's been absolutely amazing. Uh, March has been the most successful month of the year so far. We made a whole bunch of uh, revenue this month from you guys watching the video. So that's really cool as well. And yeah, if you like the video, make sure you leave a like, comment your thoughts on who you think would win. Try to be respectful in the comments. No disrespectful comments or no uh, toxicity or try to keep the toxicity to a minimum, please. And also, uh, subscribe to the channel. Turn on post notifications so that you never miss a future upload from me. And without further ado, I'm Jade Corner. Make sure you guys have a great rest of your day. Peace, love, and positivity. And I'm out this thing. Deuces.